just said, I was uh, a bit bothered. <laughs> and but I, I think it's going to be hysterical. Give it up for uh, the comfortable ninja, Mr. Allen. such as, ooh baby, the periodic table of love, and whales don't eat puppet meat. Yeah, those songs are fun. But tonight, I'd like to talk to you about something serious. Tonight I'd like to talk to you about women and their place in society. You know, in the kitchen and in the bedroom. Oh yeah, and in the workplace. I don't mean to be mean, but come on. How many women are in the audience today? <laughs> Why are you clapping? I'm trying to count. You there in the very short skirt, what's your name? I don't care. I, I can't. My refractory period, maybe. No, I'm sorry. Kelly? What do you do for a living, Kelly? I'm a student. Where do you go to school? Tulane? With me, there's two lanes, too. The vagina and the mouth. <laughs> Yes, women are very much like the elements on the periodic table. 
Now you notice that when I talked to these girls, I really didn't give a shit about their names. You know why? Because there are two types of guys in the world. One, the type of guy that a girl calls when a guy comes on her face. The other is the type of guy. <laughs> the other is the type of guy who comes on a girl's face. Now, this is why I don't learn a girl's name. Because number one, how can we be both the guy that comes on a girl's face and the guy that the girl calls? You can. It's impossible. <laughs> two, you don't have to know a girl's name to come on her face. <laughs> Watches. Cause there's a clock on the stove. Oh, yeah. <laughs> 